And there's an artist in St. James who derives her inspiration from an everyday object that most of us ignore. Rosemary Gomez has more on this week's Friday feature. There's something that some of us just take for granted, try to step over, or just plain try to avoid. But manholes hold a special fascination for Bobby Mastrangelo, a St. James artist who can really claim that her works are great. They're so fascinating because they're a replica that we can still look at of an early craftsman's work when he was really, I took great pride in the castings and the designs for them. And now we just walk all over them and take them for granted. According to Mastrangelo, there are about 2,500 existing manhole designs, many of which she has captured in her paintings and sculptures, complete with little bits of street-side ambiance like litter. Some of it is actually litter and uh, interesting cracks in the sidewalk, and the litter all started to become a part of my artwork when I became tired of sweeping it away and noticed that sometimes it fell in an interesting pattern around the grates. Litter isn't the only thing Mastrangelo uses to create realistic effects. One of her latest works contains purple footprints, just like the city street it came from. Where I thought the city streets with the purple footprints were so interesting, so my art incorporates anything that could be near a manhole cover on the sidewalks or streets. To get the desired effects, Mastrangelo makes a stencil of an existing manhole. She then transfers it to a printing press using everyday materials. I actually use old toothbrushes. I scrub in the paint in, in all the low surfaces, and then I wipe off all the high surfaces, and then take a roller of a contrasting color and run that across the top. Remnants of the artist's work can be seen all over her home, and even in some of the things she wears. When they see your art, what would you like people to think? I guess they'd like to know that I'm having fun taking a theme that was around that we walk over so much and, and say that there is real beauty into the castings of the manhole covers. Like all great artists, Mastrangelo tries to get an important message across that one man's work is another woman's art. In St. James, I'm Rosemary Gomez for News 12, Long Island. Well, that's original. Really nice. Yeah, it is original, huh? Artists can do amazing things with just about anything. I, know. I guess that's the essence of art, huh? <laughs> we'll be back.